Secret damage. Maybe start poking before it's even delivered. Uh, getting on top of mind control. He's a tanky one and he's going to be saved. GH instantly takes him out. So I'll bind into the two man silence. Kuro tries to lead forward and he's able to force staff himself away, keeping himself alive. Finally gets cut down by Nisha with the slight fist. Miracle jumps in with the ink swell stun. Puppy trying to what? offer some coverage with the Will O' Wisp. They get Nisha. Mind control over towards Yapsa and Matuma Mamatsu's trying to bring him down. The cogs, they're pushing back. Mind control, he's being healed up by GH. They're keeping the clockwork alive as Matu has taken down the ones. The trick to the trade from Miracle picks up a second kill. Nigma, can they get on top of Matu? Matu is trying to run. Puppy has got anything to offer him. And Illuminate comes blasting out with the smoke screen and the slows are there onto the Wraith King. Nigma, they'll bring Matu down. Now out comes the Global as Nigma can look to try for the cleanup. The silence onto Zai. The glaives are hitting hard. Double kill for Weeha. Four dead on secret. He feels that they can. So uh, Ricky cannot get back to base. That's what. So he's going all in here. There's no turning back. You have to go now. Oh my goodness. Does it see it? Oh, They're doing it. Too early. They're coming in with a relocate. Okay, they're bringing in Weeha. They're doing it through the backdrop protection. Secret, they're, they're going to get back. Deepest. It's too much damage. They're going to do it. Nick was going to have to win. Will oh. Wisp is out, but it doesn't matter with the PKPs. They hit the ancient. And Nigma find a way to wow. end the game. 37,000 gold down. Nice. Comes in and addresses the issue at least before it gets too to close to their end tier 2. Right Magra has a run. Yep, so. Gets the jump onto Kuro. Mind Control is going to head over and try and offer up some heals and safety. Puppy stepped outside of the base for this. Weeha with a flame break knockback. Puppy's in trouble. TPM from Miracle. The Zai Shallow Grave will come into play. But Puppy almost certainly will still fall. And now Zai, he's defenseless. Miracle just beats him down. The shield, the bubble buys him some safety, but it isn't enough. Weeha, another flame break. Knocked down, gets the kill. Nigma, they're now up to the high ground of secret. Yapso will end up dying to GH. There's four dead. They do not have the means to hold this defense. Apart from the bubble, that's all they can offer. But they can deal with the Tempest double very quickly, at least try to. They step in with the Yules playing around with it. Weeha, again, another excellent grab. He is in on to Nisha's Arc Warden. Nisha Worth is dead, costs Weeha his life. The buyback comes out from Matu, but he's tripped up the Spike Carapace. He'll look to jump away, but he jumps in on himself. Matu is dead and gone. It's a dieback on him. They're onto the tier threes. Nigma. it looks like they're, about, they're starting to run away with this game too. 30 seconds still, no Matuma man. I mean, he's looking for a setup if he finds it. And he's just making sure the space is there for Nigma to get the, the objective. They'll smoke up Puppy, but he gets forced out aggressively. Puppy just shredded, and he's going to call it. GG, it's done and dusted. Nigma will take down Team Secret 2 0 in this series, as for. I mean, Nigma, there's something about them, and we play tournaments. They really turn it up to the next level here. He's looking forward to, to turning this one. Mid lane. Well, this could be a second time, though, quite, but. Oh, no, He's no, dead. No. Global silence has popped. They'll move over towards Boxy. And Mind Control's ready to charge towards the back lines. Great shards catching both Tiger and Insania. And as much as we try to, to sort of sugarcoat it, S4, I think he might have been right. And that, that was because well, yeah. every sort of the way he moved around the map early on and, and yeah. used his early exorcisms was, was bang on. Yeah. And uh, here we go, the top fights. They're going to yeah, get hands. They are going to get Mind Control. It's going to be the buyback from Tiger in an attempt to try and turn this. There's the silence for Weeha, but of course he still has the Aegis. They'll burn through it the ones. Uh, so they can we have a snowball. We have a snowball. And they go, looking for Weeha. They're on top of him. Boxy's got some good damage with the, the actual silence. step. Snowball will save the Meepo for now. Now Miracle and Kuro have turned up. Global is out. Enigma, they're ready to turn off the back of this second life of Meepo. Mikkei just gets shredded by the army of the Meepo as he falls. Liquid have to get out of this. Miracle trying to chase Quaifer, but with the webs and the Aghanim's movement speed, Quaifer will live. For now, at least, they do still have the vision, so they, they may still try and chase on. We are going to turn his attention towards mid as Mikke is pretty aggressively positioned. He has got backup of all Insania, Boxy, and Tiger. They could turn. They look towards Weeha. They knock him back into the arena wall. Koifa comes across as well. GH buys a bit of safety with the snowball, but they still got ults to play with. The Winter's Curse holds down the two of them. Kuro looking to wrap him from the back lines, but Tiger jumps forward. Echo Slam of the River onto both Weeha and GH damage to finish them and they off. They do not. Weeha still alive. A spear knocks Kuro into the cliff. Quaifer's bear bites him down, but Liquid overall, they've lost three as Nigma are overrunning them. Weeha cannot escape. Boxy finds the trade. Miracle, GH, and Mind Control are ready to continue running them down. Snowball in from GH. Closes the gap on Quaifer. Boxy shows back Miracle with the spear, but he's got to try for this TP out. If they got anything to cancel it, they don't. So Boxy will live, but everybody else around him falls as Nigma take another compelling team fight. Uh, they're just gonna get caught bottom, probably. Flame break. 
Should be a, a good enough knockback. One more right click with the DD. We are just continuing to have an absolute whale of a time on his bat. And as we have seen in a lot of these engagements, as soon as Liquid lose one, they lose. Have so many ways to keep chasing. GH, good sharp block. The, the burning army was thrown down in an attempt to, to stop the blink from coming out from Boxy, but Boxy is able to get in, out in time before the soldiers spawn. Top lane, Koifa just getting destroyed. Miracle with this Desolator done at 18 minutes in. Chops him down in a couple of crits. It's starting to get pretty bloody here in game four. Another grab, Weeha just diving in up towards tier 3s in a lane where the tier 1 is still up. Nigma, 29 kills at 18 minutes in. They can make mind control. They're trying to commit on the Wraith King. Mind control has got Reincarnate available. Stand so he's going to be back a second time. As they can focus on a Boxy, Boxy pops the split. Miracle trying to focus quite for Snowball over from GH. The Fear will push him back. Maybe this is Liquid's opportunity to turn. The Soulbind onto the two of them. They're looking towards both of them with the stun coming out for the Brewling, connecting onto both. Miracle's getting brought low, but they've lost quite for GH. Will buy back. Miracle's been taken down the once. They'll be able to take down Mind Control a second time. Boxy split will end. We are last to control onto the Mickey Ricky as he's gone. Multiple buybacks are going to have to come out from Liquid if they want to hold on to this fight as Nigma just looked to take this. This one yet again over oh. to Insania. He's stuck. He's just gonna sort of hang on as they they just watch a little bit of peace, a little bit of solace here for, for Insania, a little bit of mercy apart from Kuro. Kuro turns up and says, "Boys, stop messing around. We've got a game to win. It's time to kill him off." Five dead on Liquid. 36 to 14 in favor of Nigma here. 20 minutes in. Self away, I think. I mean, uh, Kuro is still chasing a Wii. He's not giving up either. They're going to try and go for this one. The stone's going to connect. Kusani might be in some trouble. Tries to use the slight of this, but unfortunately, with the Magnetize, he's going to be able to easily find this kill. And now Maposhka get Magnetized up himself as well here. But they're looking towards Wii. Do they have the damage? He's dropping stones on them. Maposhka, I think he might just give his life for this one. And what is they the don't plan have here? Any damage. Roger, you've not even got two poison stacks on him. But this two. Is, this is the, the, the disgusting move that Nigma makes. Kuro Roki moves mid. Oh, sorry, the voice spirit of Astral Step, Emmerich. Oh god, that's a crit coming through onto the Poshka, but he does get himself away. And actually, Miracle, he's fighting up into Funic. Funic trying to get the Rolling Thunder out, but the crit comes in with the BKB onto you. Yeah, able to find that one down, but look at the damage out actually back onto Miracle here. But they're being careful. Nyx trying to spin himself out. Is he even able to get out of this one? No. Three daggers coming through. This might be bad. This might be detrimental actually as Nyx now caught out of position, but in comes the Ember, but the egg coming down on top of him along with the Sunray as well. It's keeping Nyx nice and healthy as they finish off the jug. Sonic going to go the same way as well. Hellraisers, they lose three. And a buyback from Funnick even committed for this one as well. But unfortunately, that fight did not go well. I mean, it's... Take a moment. Take a breather. But instant fight being forced by Hellraisers. Yeah, they're looking forward. They're looking for Poshka right now as he's getting mules up. There is going to be a disruption to make his life last a little bit longer. But, oh, okay, dodging out the roll as well. Getting himself away to the side lanes. Kasani's actually coming into this one. It feels like they're trying to force BKBs more than anything. But they're not really getting them just yet. Meanwhile, the egg has come down. But Poshka finally gets finished off. The Media fight back with the Omni side. Comes through. Takes out my control. Now trying to fight up, it's Nyx versus Miracle, the sidelines of the fight, but we get himself jumped in and Nyx is going to die in this one, but he's got the buyback to come into this. Meanwhile, another egg coming down. I mean, it's just eggs after eggs after eggs in like, the back line. They don't have egg now. They don't have BKB on Miracle. They bought back on Hellraisers. Like, they have to go here. If they don't go here, they're going to be in such a disadvantage. Kasani looking forward, Nyx chasing in. I think this is Nygma knowing what the problem there is, but Miracle losing his life, and he's losing it fast. He gets the Abyssal out onto the Poshka, but I'm just going to go away from this one. He's healing, he's healing, but is it enough? He's dying, oh, Nyx is actually dying in return. He doesn't have buyback either. Just three dead dies to the burn away, and they do not kill anybody yet, but finally they come on through. Miracle and Mind Control dead both as well. Nisani trying to fight up on the sidelines. Meanwhile, GH run away from Funnic. Funnic, though, gets hit as GH runs himself away. A little drive-by hit there. Meanwhile, Kuro, thinking he can take on Kasani here. Might be wrong about that, as he's gonna drop. Was he waiting for something? No, he was. It's PA. Oh, and the, the bash. bash! No! The bash! The worst bash I've ever seen! It's now Kasani trying to get himself out and can get at least Remnant up to the high ground. Roger trying to TP, but the best comes out down goes the shadow demon only two heroes can be up right now for hellraids to defend this one a china smog net земли цепляет нас феникса но у него диск продлить продлить диск имеется одна ульта уже герна вот потратили да если какая-то помощь майн контроль пытается застанить и байбек байбек взрывает джейч ультимейт санрей идеальный и никто не не сможет убить второе яйцо почти Боже мой, как он выжил в этой ситуации, казалось бы, уже все. 
Еще один, еще Второй один. ультимейт, но уже такой. Сани убили, и какая у нас пишет команда Hellraiser. Фан ультимейт, это и... было... Я, я говорил, что Феникс, Феникс здесь просто выиграет. Это был рефрешер с Рошана третий, да? Да, да. Скарди, you want the Skardy against the Bristleback, and also the catch onto the Weaver. Talking of going on to Bristleback, GH is well and truly on top of him, punching up into the air, and Nix is gonna lose his life. Meanwhile, finally coming in round the bout line, trying to look for Miracle, but, but he gets roared up. He's being beaten down, there's no counter play here. Just a silence out on Tim, and he can't get rid of it in time. Does lose his life. Meanwhile, Roger comes rolling onto the side here, but gets connected up with that leash. Should still be able to get forward onto Miracle here. Shallow Grave only gonna increase his death time, but he still is gonna drop. Meanwhile, in comes the Meepo. Here comes How'd the big guns, the he's starting in some trouble right now, by some trouble. I mean, he's absolutely dead. Dead to rights. Roger now the last surviving member. Swashbuckle forwards might buy him a little bit of time. Shards off the mark as well, but their snowball is certainly not. Can't be. Roger gonna get run down under the tower. Still running himself away. Gonna heal up a little bit. Make himself a little bit more tackle with the shield crash, but still killed off. We respawns, but Funnick just kind of hanging around on the sidelines. Gonna throw down a spirit vessel onto GH. Trying to get him on the side. Meanwhile, oh no, Roger. He's been caught out somewhat. Surrounded by Meepos. Absolutely encapsulated in a shell of the Meeps. That's they're gonna be able to kill him off. They haven't actually really converted this into anything. Like you've used an Aegis to get a kill on a Pangalier, and that's about it. Yeah, the tier two Maybe should the push be forward here as well. Yeah. Oh dear. This is a little fawn, which does not want to be in this way. And oh, beautiful shards actually catching out Nyx, forcing him the long way round. He's able to dodge out one net, but how many can he dodge out? One Pangalier is the only buyback. answer. A buyback for the Pangalier. Going to try and make this happen, but they're running out of health on this bristle back real damn fast. He's going to drop, conquering the middle of everything along with and Roger. Now the dive begins. Trying to do something, trying to do anything but all they are doing is dying and dying and dying again. Roger penned in, GG's are called, and the game goes to Nigma in 22 minutes flat. Quite a nice little pickup. Yeah, and the Yager, buyback favorite. for this one though, so... Oh, that smoke one smoke. could be tricky. BKB actually popped from Roger, but he's punched up into the air. They're turning around on the mic control. Look at the damage. They ripped through him in seconds. Roger does tie in response as Miracle comes in, and he is dishing out a decent amount himself, but having used his BKB early could set him up into an awkward position, but he's going down onto the low ground. Looking for Funny, but Funny, he's going to connect with the enchanters. Meanwhile, look at Nyx tearing through Kuroki, doing so much damage, and looking forward to more here. Turns around a Miracle. It's a big, beefy fight right now. Miracle is not winning that badly. Meanwhile, GH trying to roll in on the sidelines here, trying to get something done and try and buy space for his teammates to get out, but that's not going to happen. GH. He's gonna lose his life in the end as the Shao Grave not gonna keep him alive, but they turn it around. The Sroar is out onto Nyx. Is anybody gonna help him here? He's all by himself. He's all alone. Abigail doing nothing as they run him through. Down goes Nyx in response. But now Hellraiser, the, in the, again, the classic. You, you take hold Hades, but this high ground. He's a great target. Can they bring him down in time though? Abyssal comes out onto him, trying to bring down Weird. They do get the kill, but he buys back immediately. They wanna take this one. They see the end of the game is inside, but Kuro's gonna lose his life as well. No buyback on him. Miracle just trying to fight up into Roger, but Roger is in this, can't be killed. Nyx, meanwhile, gonna get the Silver Edge out onto him. The Roar coming through as well. Nyx cannot die here, does not have buyback. As they chase him around the fight, but they're looking for a different target instead. Miracle gonna find Roger, stay on top of the other side, and meanwhile, punch out onto Nyx. Nyx losing his life, getting low, getting low fast, and he is dead, does have he buyback. Had buyback. Back into it. Meanwhile, Roger trying to run away on the sidelines with the cover of the Glimmer Cape. Will be able to do so. Miracle still chasing. No, he's looking for more. Roger dies in the back lines, and now the hex immediately onto Nyx. But he looks as old as Kalasani and second side. going to pop the BKB, but the punch is out. Nyx, not again. It's the exact same way he died the first time, but it looks like there's not much going to help him out here. We with the cheese keeping himself alive, and Nyx is going to die for a second time over. 135 seconds to end this game, and they're just going to call it there. The GGs come out, and Nigma. They prove that there is a reason they call EU the strongest region, and they will take game number five, and with it, the series. Nigma are victorious. Hellraisers, they had a hell of a run.